Cavallo von der Band Tim und mit ihm rede ich über das neue Album und darüber, was er so gerne am Körper trägt. Your new album and traditional hymn style um, deals with themes like heartbreak and sorrow, but um, the songs seem a little more optimistic than your older records, so where does this sudden ray of hope come from? You know, I'm a big fan of Depeche Mode. I'm a big fan of AHA. I'm a big fan of Nick Kershaw. I'm a big fan of melancholy music that still makes you dance and or makes you want to move your hips and, and drink beer to it. So I think that, you know, it's about dancing on the razor's edge of hope and hopelessness in the lyrics and in the music. So your album cover features a nun, and considering the fact that you worked um, in your dad's sex shop... What does that have to do with nuns? Well, no, it's a, just, it's just... There is no nun exploitation. There's actually a lot of sex films with nuns. So it is a fetish. Okay. That particular cover doesn't have anything to do with the fetish. It's peculiar how a two-dimensional picture can make your brain go all funny. You know, that you can see pictures that seem to move, like a David Lynch movie, in a way that it is kind of classic and regal, but there's something very wrong with it. Yeah. Because that's exactly how the music is. Rumor has it that after concerts you don't usually go party hard. Why is that? Well, when you've partied hard enough, you know what it is. I was partying hard for, what, 10 years or something. Mm -hmm. So, it doesn't change. You have beautiful people and you have a lot of intoxicants. You were in Malibu and spent some time on, you called it holiday? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So was it the important time where everything changed? You no, know, nothing changed besides the fact that I had the um, weeks off to be able to um, get used to not drinking. You know, but it takes a while, you know, if you, if you drink a lot, you get, you know, when you, and you, if you stop like that, you get really heavy cramps, you puke, you shit your pants, you know, that kind of stuff happens. It was a nice holiday, okay. very colorful. Well, I just bought the jacket from uh, John Barbados from uh, L.A. and then the hat as well. These are from Photoshoot. These are Acne's, Swedish uh, jean brand. These are... Black Sabbath Converse I got from a friend. Just got this from a friend from Amsterdam. That's from a friend from 70s. Jesus saves belt. So, I collect stuff. How important is fashion for you in general? <laughs> well, look at me. You know, you gotta wear stuff. You can't go out in public naked. What do you bring with you when you travel? Uh, another pair of Converse, another jacket for the gig, another pair of jeans, two pairs of underwear. Okay. Two socks because what I do, I always do my laundry myself, so then I don't have to. <coughs> it's pretty clean. Okay, no, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. What about your, your hats and your scarves? Because I think that they're kind the, of the scar trademark. Well, the scarf is, you know, that's what I learned from uh, Pavarotti. Really? Uh, when you're a singer, wear a scarf at all times. And about the hat? Uh, you know, I don't have to wash my hair that often. <laughs> What's about David Hasselhoff? Because I've heard, hmm? I heard that you're a big David Hasselhoff fan. Because me too, I'm just asking. Because, yeah. Well, when I was a kid, I thought that he's the most attractive man in the world. Um, I watched Knight Rider whole day, and okay. I still do. I have this what's DVD. Night, um, what's Knight Rider in, in German? Knight Rider. Oh, it is yeah. Knight Rider, okay. <laughs> We call it Rita Riesse. Again? Rita Riesse. Okay, it sounds a bit weird. It does, well, the whole language. Finnish language sounds weird. Yeah. But David Hasselhoff. Well, you know, he's like again, he's like um, Michael Jackson. He's like an alien. You know, look at the chest hair. Look at the, his vibe. You know, he's not of this earth. I like the way he walk. He walk. I mean. I like the way he runs. <laughs> <laughs> I like the way he pushes the turbo boost. Yeah, but, yeah. <laughs> you know, it's just uh, it was a whole thing. He was such an, you know, he he is the '80s in a way. Mm -hmm. It was Top Gun. Knight Rider and Miami Vice. Okay. So, you know, I grew up with Black Sabbath and, and then Aha uh -huh, and then, you know, Kiss and then Duran Duran. So, I would the like 80s. to mix it up. Yeah. A lot of, lot of it was, was the 80s. Because okay. I was born in 76, so I bought my first albums in mm -hmm. the 80s. 
And I think I, you can hear it on, on your new album, the, well like the, the 80s yeah, yeah. anthems. Yeah, the anthems. song, the, the, the first single, Heart Killer. Mm -hmm. I, I yeah, call it the Night example. Rider riff. Really? <laughs> <You> <laughs> <did>? <laughs> it's not the same at all, but for me, I just call it the Night Rider. You, when working on an album, you always have to name riffs. Well, it makes it easier, you mm -hmm. know, because otherwise you're going to be talking, you know, the first synth riff. And that sounds boring. So I always name them. That's not, not that's the hassle hot for it. That's the original from Knight Rider. Okay. Do, 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 do. Or Kraftwerk. Somewhere in between. Okay. You know, like um, Cyborg, David Hasselhoff. Okay. I think I'm going to listen to Heart Kill again. Yeah. <laughs> With that in mind. About, think about the chest there. <laughs> or Hasselhoff. Get there. And the walk. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I and will. the walk. <laughs> okay. And the burger. The burger thing. <laughs> Did you like it? Like the burger video with his well, um, daughter. Sad, it? Yeah, it is. It's really sad to put it on stuff like that and put, put it on YouTube. You know, if somebody's got personal problems, it's not. You know, but obviously it is super funny. Yeah. It's because it's funny to watch people being drunk out of their heads. Mm hmm. Especially nowadays. So are there kind of videos about you being drunk? Oh, uh, probably, yeah. I, I don't know. Yeah, I don't okay. Know. I haven't, like, been Googling myself up that much. Okay. Really, like, drunk. <laughs> you know, doing a stupid <laughs> thing. I don't know. I'm, I'm sure that some, something might pop up. <laughs>